Well, the reason bleach baths were created, it sort of uh, came about way back in, in the days of uh, World War I, World War II, uh, when people were getting injured by bullets and bombs and shrapnel and they needed things to kind of clean wounds. And it was discovered that actually a bleach product could clean wounds and keep uh, soldiers from getting infections. And as time went on, it, it became sort of thought that, well, perhaps the same type of product could be used for other diseases other than people that are getting injured in battle. The reason bleach baths are still used in this day and age is that they're very effective and they're also quite cost effective. They're not very expensive to do. And compared to using an antibiotic, which bacterial resistance can develop, the bleach baths do not have that as a problem. I would say about five to 10 years ago, it became more common practice within pediatric dermatology to use bleach baths diluted in order to decrease staph aureus, which was a complicating factor in atopic dermatitis. Uh, the good news about things like bleach and other topical agents like this is that they can actually kill MRSA and help to prevent some of these problems. The most common recommendation for bleach baths